Hello there, everybody. Welcome back to more uh, Iris and the Giant. Many of you expressed, uh, hey, Tyler, this game's pretty cool. So you know what? We're going to check it out some more uh, and continue to do a little bit of work with it. So we do have some gifts left over uh, from last time. We also now have some imaginary friend action. So we have this guy for sure, uh, but it also appears... Okay, so this one, 20 demons carry a star on their head. Sure. Uh, and reach 8th floor without using any memories. Uh, so, like, look, we are gonna use memories, um, cause I- Oh, you know what, dude? I- We- we did this. We did do this. Um, we did- we did do this. So it just- it did- I- apparently I maybe didn't save, uh, what I did. That's fine. Let, let's start a new run here. Uh, you guys did- you did let me know some things that I, uh, that I maybe did wrong in the last episode, um, also known as I'm kind of an idiot, right? Uh, the bow can, can hit people in the back, dude. That completely changes, like, pretty much everything. So I, I can attack this guy right now. Um, that, that's a, like, legitimately huge difference, uh, because now, I mean, we can effectively, we can effectively clear these rooms almost immediately right like that that just saved us so much time um because we don't we don't have to we don't have to wait on these guys so i'm gonna take more bows and then let's actually take some shields i think shields are, are quite good so how do i want to do this i want to start with this what are you steel steel jaw traps in his pocket okay this this is chill uh we'll take these beautiful and then I'm going to do one of those. And then... Can I... Apparently I can't get to those unless I, uh... Unless I hit the rock, huh? I don't think it's worth it. Uh, I'm just gonna leave. I'm just gonna leave. Dude, this is changing, like, everything. Um, what a... What a complete... Complete turnaround that we have had. So I can go for you in the back. Dude, it's so different. <laughs> I feel like an absolute dumbass, for the record. Uh, I hope that you understand that. So I gotta attack you three times. The thing is, you're you're not gonna hit me right now. So I'm kind of chilling. Let's take these. Let's take more shields, and then we'll grab these real quick. Uh, kind of a kind of a scuffed situation here. But that's okay. We we get a level up. Uh, what do I want immediately? So this is more stars from demons. Uh, crystal will give you one will point. We'll find one more crystal. Draw five cards instead of four. Uh, this this is good. It's very good. I think we will do that. So no damage taken there. Um, I do think I'm probably in a position. I do want a shield here. Um. Yeah, it's going to be a shield followed by a one of these. That wipes the hell out of them. And then we can go for the extra turn. And then let's smack you. And I don't have much to my name here, dude. I don't got much to my name. So this guy, I mean, he's hitting us for seven. It's a lot, right? It's a lot. Also, who? What? What are you doing? It's extra golden hourglass. I didn't know that. Okay. Uh, I mean, kind of a kind of a crappy position for us. There's not much we can do here. Um, so I will just instead hit this guy. They're they're gonna smack the hell out of me. Um, so we'll hit you again. You'll hit me for one. I will take the the magical star to level up. Uh, what do we want? I can play all the arrows in my hand. Additionally, I get one arrow at the beginning of each floor. I mean, that, that's all of a sudden way better than before. Uh, when I play a confidence card, it turns into a flame. You can play this turn. Damage of three and more reduced by one. Let's let's do more arrows because uh, that ends up benefiting us. Anything that adds more cards is good. Okay, we've, we've seen this one. You guys said you want you're very interested in the lore of the game, which is... Look, I mean, do I care about the lore of the game? I don't. But if you do, then I will do what I can uh, to provide you with the lore of the game. 
but we've already seen that one so i'm not i'm not providing you with the lore of the game if you are too lazy to go watch the first episode okay we're chilling give me give me these give me these at this point we are exclusively bow men bow bow why did i waste my bows when i could have just left right probably not the brass idea this is where the game actually starts getting hard but we're probably going to be better than before right probably going to be better than before this is kind of a scuff situation let's do this and then so you you're actually not too bad um let's do this he hits me then we do something like this i get hit with one arrow that's okay we're gonna smack you that gives me the extra turn and we get a level up gotta love it okay uh let's go <laughs> drawing six cards instead of five dude i'm gonna just i'm gonna go all in on that and my reasoning is i think that i will take these i think that there's value in going for the big time ow going for the big time play with uh wow this is horrendous i hate that that did not go according to plan hey, what's up with this guy it allows enemies to attack twice okay yeah you gotta go hey he's gonna attack twice i you know you'd think he'd learn huh you'd think he'd learn i can play again so restore all my will let's i don't think we need to i don't think we need to we're gonna kill him that gives us a uh, magical demon star good stuff and what we got here when i take a chance and draw again i gain 10 will every seven crystals i pick up i gain an axe card which appears directly in my hand when a card ends up in my bag i gain a will let's do this i think that that's at least unique uh and then i will continue to just do axes and bows dude axes and bows as far as the eye can see so i believe this might be the furthest we've ever gotten uh, i think we're sitting way better right now than we ever have so that's a good sign for us we're gonna smack you that's extra turn we smack you extra turn i'm gonna open the chest uh give me give me these and these part of my strategy is taking the most possible stuff as well uh in case you didn't know so if i hit him bomb goes off blows up like a lot of people then we're gonna do the same thing up here bomb goes off hits a lot of people the strategy is 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 deep now so we have one extra turn let's attack front row here i'm gonna pick up some crystals we level up because of that which is beautiful uh and then what do we want ladder to immediately climb to the next floor break the shield and armor of an enemy and the card returns I mean, that's that's pretty good. Attack an opponent in front of me. If they're defeated, I steal a card. I mean, so these these are interesting because they allow us to do some stealing. But, dude, this, this tornado action. I'm pretty intrigued by this. Uh, so, let's, let's pop this. And he... So, we're, we got smacked around a little bit there. But I think it's okay. We still have the shield up. So, this... I can play again after this. I can reduce the shield and armor of an enemy. So if I reduce your shield, you Dao don't have a shield. Okay. I mean, that does make sense. You're going to hit me. I take no damage. How do you play this in a way that gives you the best benefit uh, of winning? You hit him. You hit him again. Two damage taken. Then you go for the flame here. We level up. Okay, good stuff. Uh, and then we'll be able to basically hop down into the thing. So, earning will back. I, I'm, I'm interested in just increasing my will. Getting, getting, you know, HP back is less of a concern for me. I feel like we, we, we handle our heals pretty well. Uh, I mean, hell, we got two full restores just sitting right here. So you're, you have shield. Okay, hate that hit you too uh and then i'll put up a block gonna need to draw like good cards <laughs> i know this uh 
it's a tall ask. But uh, we are in a little bit of a, an awkward position right now. I mean, these guys all have attack of one. This guy doesn't. I mean, he's very scary. He's in attack of like 27. I would prefer not to do that. Uh, then I'll take this. Give me these. Give me shields. I did notice this guy threw a sorrow card. This card will make me lose five will points. Okay, so these guys suck. <laughs> they are they are terrible. I have no interest in dealing with them. I think really our best play is to just leave. Um, or else we are going to take a lot of damage and lose a lot of stuff. So here is Flaming Floor. I think this is the furthest we've ever gotten. Uh, and we're in the best shape we ever have. It's crazy how when you learn a mechanic of the game, things actually go better for you. Uh, so give me shield. Give me some axes. I feel like we're we're running a little low. Okay, never mind. We're not running low on axes at all. We are running low on the wills, though. We have both of them in our hand. So we should probably chill on that. So this guy we need to attack with regular hits. Whereas these guys I can burn. Except you're huge. Okay. So we're going to start with the shield. And I'm actually going to play both of my shields. We're, we're going to be here for a while. I can't even see the damn floor right now. So let's not... Let's not jump too far ahead. I am going to do this to bring people to the front here. Because then I can hit you with this one. And now things now things are going. He's back, dude. Wow, the burning is minus 8 health. It's very not good. Um, I think we have to do it. Oh, that's so good. If I knew that's how that worked, I would have done that way differently. Okay. Well, then let's do this guy too. We we lose. Oh god, dude. They're they're hitting. We do have shields though. Okay, you need to do Well, you need to pop your shield. We're still going to be here a while. So, pop the shield. Then you go for the axe play. And we ha we have to get rid of damn Cerberus, dude. Uh, so this will help. Um, we can then bow him and leave. Is that how we want to do this? I'm very close to leveling up. So you know what? I think we can afford to do this. We level up here. Each floor two demons will... On each floor two demons will be tougher. Okay, um, let's, let's try it for the chance of some, we didn't full heal, dude. Okay, so we will full heal now. Or else we would have actually literally died, so probably an intelligent idea. You're probably like, Tyler, what is, what is your plan here? I have no idea. Um, I, I have, I've worked this one up. They will all die. Okay. On the bright side, we, we get the level up here. When I play a confidence card, it turns into a flame card. Take a chance and draw again, 10 will. If the will points are below five, immediately find a confidence. Let, let's do this. So this is the confidence is the restore all. So that now will put a flame into my, into my hand. In the distance. I don't think we've seen this one. I'll be quiet. Is that the sound of tears falling? An old sorrow that weighs heavy upon my heart. Alright. The lore, dude. So deep. So vivid. Uh, okay. How are we gonna handle you? This is kind of a scuff turn, to be honest. Uh, this guy is also... He's bad. We're also running out of cards, uh, which is important to note. <laughs> going on down here oh i can draw again i never knew that was a thing dude i don't i don't think that's what we want to do here we have good cards it's just figuring out how we want to do them so i think you want to do something the problem is we we need more bows to take out these shield boys 
So that's just two damage in the end. Definitely need more shields. I definitely need more bows too. Dude, we only have two bows in the deck. That is not good. Also the Grim Friggin' Reaper out here. Steals cards. Trying to think if maybe there's a different approach we should take here. Pop the shield first. This buys me a turn. Let, let's burn this row. Yikes. Okay. Um. We're, we're going to take hits here. I don't, I'm not sure there's much that I can do about this. What I want to do, I want to... Now we're in bomb range. If we do this, that takes care of a lot of people. And we're still somehow able to take more turns, which I... I will not uh, turn that down. It's because I killed uh, I killed one of these guys. Exactly. Okay. I hit the wrong thing. <laughs> okay. Now, now I'm salty because I did not mean to hit that. Now I will do that. Take my extra turn. Smack you people. You're my uh, extra dude. I'm going to break your shield. And then we're going to hit you. We'll take one damage here. Never mind. We got an archer in the back as well. Hey, hey, what's what's your deal, buddy? Okay. Yeah, you're you're an a-hole. Sure. Say goodbye. I'm taking a lot of damage again. We do have a full restore, so let's keep that in mind. And we can actually we could do an interesting play here. Uh it's called No, never mind. We're actually in great shape. So we'll do this. All you can hit me again. That's fine. And then we'll do this. All of you will hit me for three. I have a full restore. I'm not... Oh, God, that hurt. I'm not super worried yet. Uh, right now, we're taking three damage, so I don't need to fret. Let's instead only take two. What is this obelisk over here, dude? Kind of interested in that. Uh, we're, we're taking a chunk. We're taking a chunk. I think we should restore Will. Burn an enemy. Say goodbye to that guy because he, he scares me. And then we'll hit you. We're, we're running out of cards. I mean, that's that's definitely a big problem right now. I think you have to take a chest to get more cards. Um, I think you got to do something like this. That, that at least puts more swords in. We, we can still utilize the swords, right? I think these are our exits, dude. Yeah, okay, those are the exits. We'll, we'll work with it. It's a mimic, dude. I hate, I hate you. I hate you with every, every bone in my being. I really don't want to open this up for the Grim Reaper to come in, but it's fine. Uh, Let's do... If I do this, that then, because we have this, I can leave. Okay. I think we're we're nearing the end, right, of this run. What are what are the holes in the ground, dude? The sorrow which infects this demon is tremendous. Pardon me. Not really sure what to do about that. Um. So he's dead. I'm gonna pop this. I'm gonna take those for obvious reasons. So what do what do you do with with this? Ah, okay. I see. Okay, yeah, this it's not good. So I'm gonna I'm gonna play this. I'm gonna play all these. And my reasoning is uh, I got no reason not to. Okay. Can't get those yet. So now how do I wanna handle this? I wanna I wanna do something like Pop a shield. Pop another shield. I don't think we need to pop another shield. Um, so now... I'm going to end my turn. It's kind of wonky. Let, let's do this. He comes up. He hits me. Nothing happens. I kill him. And we're, we're kind of chilling. Do I want these? I think so, yeah. Uh, so let, let's spend two of those. I'm then going to play this as well. 
And then I think we will probably restore Will. I probably should have done it now um, to draw cards immediately. These guys are all going to have damage. Ghost Cat Cat can't be targeted. I'll have to use indirect ways to reach it. Gotcha. I understand. Full understand, dude. Okay. That's not an issue. We also full full healed. Do we full heal on each floor? Is that something that I like picked up or something? Or am I just stupid? There, there's a decent chance it's the the ladder there. So you're you're dead. Got two big ass rocks in the way, dude. Which uh, it might be a good thing for the record. So the archers can shoot me through this stuff. Let's knock you. Let's also knock you. Ow, you're you're a you're a buff boy. Would have been a great time for uh Oh, you're a buff boy too. Ow. Yeah, okay. It hurts. Be a great time for a flame. There's three of them in the deck. Uh would be a really great time for a flame. Just throwing it out there. Ow, ow, ow. Just a lot of damage, dude. Oh, this is a great play. Beautiful. Still like a lot of damage over and over and over. That's a great time for a flame. Do I want to do a full heal first though? I don't think we need to. No, I do. I do need to. Uh, full heal. Burn in a line. I level up because of that. Good stuff. Okay. Nerve. I mean, look, it starts to get a little scary. A shield card protecting you is good, and we get a shield on top of it. That that blesses us a good deal. So what are you guys? Make me lose the power of my magical items. I see. So I could nuke this. I don't know what that does, though. But there's clearly something back here. Let, let's try it. And I would like to get to this. So now we do something like... You, you play the shield. That way you don't get hit. Then you do a burn. That bombs. And then we can do like... Uh, knock out that. And then I can snag this. And this is a memory. Stop it with your video games, Iris. For heaven's sake, we're in a restaurant. Don't you want to tell me about your day? No, I don't. Thanks. Okay, continuing. Um. So here's here's what we have to do. Okay, that does not do anything good stuff. Um, we have to. You're glitched. This has a sword on it. <laughs> this guy's like a super archer. So I have to find a way. There's still a burn in the deck. I have to find a way to knock out this stone. There's the flame. Honestly, this is this is okay, but I don't want to do it yet. I want to knock out this stone. I know I'm taking hits too. I want to knock out the stone. I need you to come up so that I can do this. And he's he's very scary, dude. Yeah, attack of eight. It's not good. He's still got a lot of shield too. I will first full restore. We only have four cards, dude. Then you do this. That nukes everything. I snag this. <laughs> it's getting a little dicey. Um, throw daggers to strike a demon of the second row. Chest now offer one more dagger card. My bag is better protected. Thieves have a 50% chance not to steal. I'm not sure if I like any of these. Um, but I, I guess I'll do that. And then I'm actually going to kind of go big or go home here. Um... And I think that that was worth it. We spent one card to get, like, five. So that seems useful. What, what, what exactly is going on here, huh? What's going on here? Wh who are you? 
buddy. The Hydra. The heads of the first two rows can attack. So you're telling me they're about to hit me for 24? Well, that seems a little excessive, to be honest with you. Um, okay. I understand. To be fair, we are we are built pretty well to handle this. In fact, I think if I can just... Nope, they're back already. Okay. I only have one card in the deck. We're dead. But you know what? This was a, this was a good run. Um... Yeah, we, we we cannot handle the Hydra, uh, not with this one singular card in my deck. Uh, I will, in fact, die here. Um, rough life, dude. Rough life. But we, we progressed a good amount uh, and uncovered some new things. We're also definitely going to be able to do some upgrades and things like that. Uh, I'm feeling good. So here's our rewards for the next game. We have six Axe cards. Fantastic. I could exchange that, but I, I have no interest. Uh, two Deluge cards. I don't even know what the hell that means. Sure. Uh, new Imaginary Friend reached th floor 13 without playing any confidence cards. Cool. We'll, we'll find Mimic Boy eventually. And a Leer card. Interesting. Uh, I wish I knew what any of these things did. Um, but that's, that's part of the fun of a roguelite, right? Part of the fun of a roguelite, not knowing anything that's going on. So another memory... Uh, you find wave cards in chests. They have a lot of different effects on opponents. I start with only six sword cards, but I will find two chests on the first floor. Thunder cards. Oh, dude, thunder cards are very good. They're very good. They're very good. I can get to it. Okay. <laughs> I don't really know how this system works, to be completely blunt with you. Uh, and we did not find any new... Uh, new imaginary friend friends because I, I I'm still using memories I probably could uh, I probably could replace them and try to get this guy which it'll probably benefit us right you know what here's here's a uh, here's here's Tyler's hot take of the day I'm gonna I'm gonna take off all of these okay that means that this guy I now have a lot of chances to get going to floor eight next episode we're gonna do that uh and we're going to use no memories trying to make it to floor eight uh so we can unlock this guy i'm also trying to think 20 demons that carry a star on their head due to nerve improvement i don't know if that's in one game like one run or or what but we'll try to do that too floor 13 without playing any confidence cards that's not easy for the record like that is not easy at all. I'd love to know what floor... I don't know if there's a way for me to see. I've only reached floor 12, dude. Okay, yeah. there's there. That one's not going to happen for a while. But we improved. We're doing good. Thank you so much for watching. As always, if you're enjoying Iris and the Giant, please let me know uh, so I can continue to make more of it. This really is a beautiful game uh, with, uh, with a lot of really fun uh, roguelite deck building mechanics. But thanks so much for watching. I'll catch you guys later. You have a good one. Goodbye.